Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you everything new in the Vault update in Fishing Simulator. So first off, you're going to want to come over here to Reagan's Tavern. And once you enter, you're going to want to come over to these stairs up here. And right here you can see you can talk to a guy named Crazy Charlie. And once you talk to him, you can actually put storage in here. So anything like fish or drops from sea creatures, you can store in here. And right now you can see I have a whale key in here. And you can also see that my storage is 20, which means that I can have 20 things in here but if you wanted to you can press buy more space and right here you can see I can upgrade to 40 space but it costs 45 shards. Another thing related to this is they added a game pass. It's called Bigger Vault and basically it doubles the amount of space you can have in your vault. It is a bit pricey though coming in at a thousand robux. They also added two other game passes this one right here called Tackle Box. It's where you can equip if you have multiple baits in your inventory you can equip all of them at the same time. And and the last one, Anchor, where you can anchor your boat down so it won't move when it gets hit by weather or other players. So the next little cool thing I want to show you guys, you can come over to here in Port Jackson to Mayor Eliza, and you can talk to her and you'll be able to change the name of your pet. So you'll just select your pet here, and it does cost a little Robux, but you will be able to change the name of your pet, which I find is pretty cool. I like the concept of it. You can also now hold a spear and an axe at the same time. Also, I believe now when you buy stuff like a backpack it'll show a little coin effect so i'm going to show you guys it So you can see it just like subtracted the amount of coins I had. I'm not sure if it did that before. I don't think it did. And finally, I thought this was really cool, but when you go in your fish index, you'll actually be able to hub over the rewards and you can see the statistics of them. And this goes for anything. Like if you go over to something with the speciality, it shows that too. So besides that, the rest of the update was just fixes and improvements, such as like fixing some issues with Moby Wood. Also recently, they've been uh, doing a lot of void storms and for some reason they're like not ending it like it'll end and then it just comes back also right now in stock till sunday you can get the heart of the forest rod which has a five percent mutation chance i know it's kind of unrelated but i just wanted to show you guys but yeah i hope this video helped you guys out thank you guys for all the support recently i really appreciate it have a great rest of your day